have to grind grain again, and we're using a Stouffer manufactured uh, horsepower grain grinder. It was probably manufactured 100 years ago. We here at the Oak Tree Ranch, we restore these, we restore the Stouffers. The ones we prefer the most, most are uh, the sandwich. This one here was made in Freeport, Illinois. And we'll show you some of the features of it. Here on the top, you got a knob that you turn and it'll adjust your grain. You can go from cracked corn all the way to, to literally flour if you adjust it up tight. This here one has a feature where you can open it up and clean the bottom out where the grain falls. We've got a sweep mechanism here that sweeps the grain into the bucket. And your grain comes out around here. This cone has all little uh, teeth on it that grinds the grain. And today we're going to be, we'll grind barley. And our recipe is, is one bar, two barleys. And one corn, I gotta go get another barley. Okay, okay today we're gonna use ebony on the grinder. She's a percher on there. First you bring her over and What we've got over here is a, is a bar that we use to stabilize her so she goes around, will stay in her circle that she walks. So she doesn't uh, get lost. of equipment. They usually go, if they've been doing it for a while, they'll go around by themselves without anybody driving them. But usually to start out, we'll drive them to uh, make sure everything is good to go. And it's Pretty easy, she just walks around in a circle, turns the grinder. Like I said earlier, we rebuild, rebuild, rebuild them here as we can find them. They're kind of hard to find. Uh, there was a lot of different manufacturers of them but back in the day, but uh, they're kind of scarce. So any help in leads would be appreciated. <laughs> Step up. I use them on here 
And then they're pretty well uh, ready to go because when we put them on a big horsepower sweeps and we do teams in, and it doesn't seem to bother them when they step over the tumble rod or anything because they're all used to grinding and feed. It's still a five gallon bucket. And the horse takes a little over two and a half rounds a minute, so it takes about five minutes to grind a five gallon bucket full of feed. <laughs> 